Were they telling the truth in this episode of The West Wing? Hey. We spent millions of dollars developing a pen for the astronauts that would work in zero gravity. You know what the Russians did? They used a pencil? They used a pencil. The character jokes that NASA spent millions developing a pen that could write in space, while the Russians just used a pencil. That was a clever line, but it leaves out two major facts. First, NASA didn't spend millions. Paul Fisher, an independent inventor, did. He invested his own money, about $1 million reportedly, to create the zero-gravity pen, which works upside down, underwater, in extreme temperatures, and yes, also in space. And here's the other thing. Both NASA and Soviet astronauts did use pencils at first. So why were they so eager to switch to pens? There were legitimate safety concerns. Pencil tips can break, and because graphite conducts electricity, it can short-circuit electronics or even pose health risks if inhaled. So when Fisher offered a safer alternative, both space agencies adopted it. Not because they wanted to show off a fancy pen, but because in space, safety always comes first. 